so as you can tell from the title of today's video this is going to be what i'm supposed to ash your lips <laughs> ash your lips we're almost sure it's my lips ashy i use black camera so we can check because I wanted to see what my hair would be like and just for the experience I know I'm just tired of it because it's just so it's a lot a lot goes into combing it a lot goes into um, just telling it worse if I can't clean you and worse if I can't comb it on here like me although I do try so I'm actually thinking of going back to relaxers so but I am testing the waters with this silk press so I decided to get a silk press first and um, when we see how that turn out, we will fully decide if we want to commit to going back to relaxers. So anyway, long story short, come with me to get so pressed and uh, yeah. So guys, for the prepping, she said that I was to ensure that my hair was freshly washed. I washed my hair like two days ago, but she said that we're supposed to still wash it right before the appointment. So I just washed my hair and I have it in two plaits right now and then just have this cap over it. And I let it air dry from last night. Head northwest on Grants Pen Road towards Shortwood Road. Okay guys, so I'll just be doing a voiceover for this part. So she's just getting me ready for the whole silk press experience. She's sectioning my hair and she's going to go ahead and blow dry each section. My hair look horrible. <laughs> but honestly, I never comb it out because I tell me that I have a three day migraine and I was just not having it. But I did wash it. So I think she's spraying heat protectant on it, using the brush to detangle. And then she's going to go in with the blow dryer. Look at that length. The shrinkage is really real. <laughs> like, honestly, truly. So she's just she's just blow drying the other sections and detangling and just repeating the whole process until my entire head is fully blown out. So now we're fully blown out, I think she's adding more heat protectant because she's going to go through again and use a brush to blow dry it this time. I think she wants to get closer to the root to straighten it. So all the kinks, I have full blown 4C here. So she's trying to get it as straight as possible before she goes in with the first round of the flat iron. So as you can see, she's just going through once more with the blow dryer and getting it closer to the roots and just getting it as straight as possible for the second round. Now she's parting it and she's getting ready to go ahead and section it off for the silk press process. So the silk press process is basically flat ironing so she's gonna go through twice with the flat iron this is the first round and she's using very small sections she's going through while using a tail comb to keep the hair as straight as possible and she's just using the flat iron from the root to the end of the hair to get it as straight as possible guys can you see all that new growth from my roots remember when i dyed my hair in my previous video all this black is new growth like do you see it do you see it, girl yes girl it looks so good 
so she's just continuing that process throughout my entire head and I will be back once that is completed I'm back again <laughs> so she's also using the hot comb to get as close to the root as possible because you want to get the root straight as well so she did a really good job I'm actually really impressed with how this turned out you'll see her using the flat iron and the hot comb and she's interchanging them and using them at different points is to achieve the same results but the flat iron I think she used that because it's easy I'm sorry but the hot comb is easier to get close to the roots so you'll see her use the hot comb from time to time and she's parting it in really small sections Now we are at the front and she's just going to repeat the same process as she did for the back. Now we are finished with the first round of the flat iron. So now she's going to trim my ends. So she's just going to go through, section it and give me a nice little trim. This trim is long overdue like I haven't processed my hair in about 4 or 3 years and since then i have not gotten a trim and even before that it's been years since i've gotten a trim so this was well overdue when i was younger i used to hate it getting my ends clipped but now i love <laughs> i love how my hair looks when the ends are clipped i love how it feels it's full and i just love it i, lo I mostly love how it looks So she added more heat protectant and she's going through now for the second round of the flat ironing. While giving the ends a little curl. And as you can see again she's going in with the flat iron to get the roots and those little the edges the the hard to reach parts not flat iron the hot comb sorry she's using the hot comb to straighten the hard to reach parts of my hair so everything is basically extremely straight she did an excellent job like i'm watching this over and i'm just so impressed honestly okay guys so that was quick now she is wrapping it um she's finished with the second round and she's wrapping it she's going to wrap it and she's going to put me under the blow dryer <laughs> under the blow dryer <laughs> 
under the oh my gosh why can't i remember the name what is wrong with me my name again oh my gosh guys i cannot rem remember the name of this thing but that's what she's putting me under i'm a natural hair girl i have not been to the salon in ages don't judge me so yes guys this is the finished look and i'm loving it i'm not sure how long this is going to last but i'm going to try to make it last it looks so good and i'm actually thinking of going back to relaxers depending on how long this lasts i don't know maybe i'll start doing this to my hair or if this not last long enough like if this only lasts like a one day or a two day or i'm only get like a one wear out of it i'm definitely going back to relaxers <laughs> because it's just the ease and your hair is just so easy to manage and it's straight and you know have no problem to style it and yeah i love all of that okay guys so that's it so it's a rain right now so let me just leave it in this wrap so we can so it cannot just revert to what it was before like we just waste all of my money so I trimmed my ends as you could see in the video so yeah that's it i love it but may i think for die about my hair black but uh, if you enjoyed this video please leave me a like remember to leave me a comment down below and subscribe if you're not subscribed bye guys